We're going live. You're alive. Is this Mary Beth? We're live. Let's see if anybody comes on and hangs out with us. All right. It feels good to be live. We haven't been live in a while, honey. Hello, hello, hello. We're here. Hey, one person is here. We got one viewer. Our first, this is our first live feed on YouTube. We're going to have a good time. Nah, nah, nah. Going to have a good time. Yeah. Hey, hey, hey. It's Fat Chubby and Mistress Mary Beth in her moo moo. Yeah. Yeah. I'm clapping my feet up. Oh, whoever it was left. Yeah. Oh, well. So much for that. Hmm. It may take a little time for us to get some folks on here, you know? Mm hmm. But I'm sure they'll come. Mm. Hi, Mrs. Merriman. Oh, I look like a hot mess here. So do I. But we'll tell them what happened with you today. If anybody comes on, that is. Mm. We'll see. Hmm. You know where my glasses were this whole time? Where were your glasses, darling? On my head. Oh, my God. Oh, my Godness. I was having one of them there. My God, goodness. Moments, I think. My godly goodness. Yes, yes. My good to Godness. That, too. So let's see if anybody finds us. What do you think? Yeah, I don't know. So far, no one's found us. Well, I think we should talk about some shit anyway. Let's talk about you and Bob. You had, you really went at Bob with that uh, Bob's a bitch. baseball bat. Bob's a bitch. Bob is a bitch. Why is Bob a bitch? First of all, Bob is our boxing dummy outside. Hi, everybody. This is going to be our first live stream from bed mm -hmm. on um, YouTube. Myself and the mother of all spankings, Mistress Mary Beth. Say hi, Mistress Mary Beth. How you doing? She's got her blue moo moo on today. Mm -hmm. My little honey. And um, we're partying here. Hey, I got one like. We got one like. So feel free to comment, everybody. We'd love to hear from you. This is our first um, live stream on YouTube. We got kicked off Facebook for... Face, face, deck, face, douche. Yes. We got kicked off a of face douche for being douchey. Yes, apparently. I'm and gonna... apparently, we're we're not douchey enough. I'll say something. Damn it! Who's saying what? I'm trying to say something. Oh. Hi. People that left. That's it, man. I don't know, maybe. So far, we're not doing mm. too good. Let's see if it picks up. Damn it. Hey, how about that Will Smith bitch Ooh. slapping Chris fucking... That was some funny What's his shit. name? It was it's funny stupid, shit. But... Hmm. I know what I was going to do. I was gonna what were you doing? Go on Facebook and yeah. find you. Uh -huh. And then... But share, we're on YouTube, though. Right. Share what you've posted about this. Uh -huh. Because sometimes people see we're waiting stuff. If we see, if we get some people, but no one's found us yet. It's going to be a little tricky. Well, hey, there'll be none of that on the live feed now. What? There's none of that on the live feed. None of what? Nothing. What did I do? Nothing. You didn't do anything. No. <laughs> so how about those mats, huh? Yeah, the mats. Hmm. hmm. Well, I hope some folks come on and join us on this year live stream. I should go on. Oh, I should find us on the phone, shouldn't I? I should say I'm on Facebook. Now, Facebook's probably blocking it. Mm. Crazy. Facebook bumped us, bumped us off and wouldn't even tell us why. So we're doing this on YouTube for the first time. We're very excited about that. Very excited to be here with you on the Book of the Face. Yeah. That is. Oh. Oh, I didn't even put the address on. Had it post. I gotta put the. It has it. Could you click the picture? No, not this one. Oh. <laughs> Apparently, I didn't. Let me see if it's on Papa Chubby. Hmm. 
Hello. Oh. Well, that's funny. Yeah. Close my silly face. Here we go. Oh, that's what I was doing. Yes, it's on okay. Facebook, but Oh, hey, how you doing? Who's hanging out there? Who just joined us? It's like we're desperate for friends. We're that couple who has no friends. And we, hi, hi, come on in. My wife made some hors d'oeuvres. Maybe you'd like to play some backgammon. Uh, nah. No. Maybe you'd like to smoke some motherfucking weed with us. Because that's what we do about this time we're hitting the weed. That's right, yeah. Yeah, I got a little nuggy here, a little nuggy hmm, of loveliness. Mm. I'm going to curb a churb, as we say. Curb a churb, curbing, we say. Curbing How do the we veritable. know who those people are? I don't know. They don't tell us. That's a problem. That is a Just problem. tell us we've got two people. Maybe if I click on it. Maybe. Unless they comment, we'll never know. Oh. Y'all got to comment. I guess I got to find that and go there. No entries found, huh? No, now we got three. Hey guys, how you doing? It's Papa Chubby, Mistress Mary Beth. Um, you can interact with us by yeah, let's interact. We can't yeah. see it's who these people are. On the live stream. Let me see. Participants, here we go. Papa Chubby, that's it. Hey. What? I found us. What'd you do? And it says, Oh, Neil Hunt. You got a bud. Hi, Neil. A shed full. He actually left a comment? Yes. How come I'm not getting it? I don't know. Oh, there you go. You got a bud. Why I got shed. a shed full. Neil, where you at, man? If you got a shed full of, of weed, I want to come and be your buddy, man. I want to come hang out with you. I promise not to Will Smith you, man. Maybe you could Will Smith me sometime. And we could just smoke all your weed up. That'll work for me, brother. So this is not very exciting right now, is it? No, we don't. I'm trying to get the hang of this, too. <coughs> we got to get back on Facebook, I think. <coughs> There's no way to do it for 29 days, my darling. I don't know. You believe that? I don't know. We are being punished. We're being shunned. We're being face shunned. <laughs> Facebook shunned. Yeah. Thrown off the book. <laughs> As we're all right. This didn't work out too well. Hey, how you doing? Oh, hi, MBK. <laughs> how are you? It's so nice to see you. I'm hoping some other folks finds us. You know? Yeah. But um, so far, Neil, you didn't tell me where you're from, bro. You just said you got a shed full of weed, but I want to know where you live so I can come hang, man. Down in Australia. It's Bureau Clock, brother. Cheers. Is that what he said? That's what he said. How come I'm not getting that? There oh, there it goes. Bureau Clock. Ah, Down Under. The man from Down Under. Neil from Neil Hunt from Down Under. Mm. I live in the land down under. Do, 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 do. La, 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 la. Yeah, Neil. Well, that's cool, brother. Cheers to you, too, my brother. It's always beer o'clock somewhere. That's true. It's always weed o'clock. It's always 420 somewhere. No, that's not true, is it? <laughs> I don't know. It's only, it has to be 20, I guess. It'll be 420 somewhere. I guess. I don't know. All right. If, hmm, that's an interesting question. Is it always 420 somewhere? Is it always 420 somewhere? Somebody answer me here. We got five people here now, babe. We're getting... Ooh. How you all doing, man? You ever smoked Thai stick in the south of Thailand? No, I did not. I never smoked Thai stick in Thailand, but I smoked Thai stick in Flushing, Queens when I was a kid. But a lot of times I thought they just took shitty Colombian bud and wrapped it around a stick with a piece of string <laughs> and charged more for it. Well, that's pretty lame. How about y'all? You ever smoked Thai stick in the south of Thailand? <laughs> Thai rave. <laughs> 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 
<coughs> some new characters on here. I like yes. this. None of our Facebook people have come over yet. No, they're probably sleeping. It's too so, Mistress Mary Beth, how are you today? It's the middle of the week. How are you today, my dear? I'm okay. Yeah, you're I doing had all right? a tough day. You had a rough day, huh? I napped a bit. I oh, had a little nappy. Mm -hmm. Good, man. Um, Larry. Any spankings today? Oh, there's bad boys everywhere. Oh, oh Mistress Mary Beth. Wow. Always with the spankings with Always. you. Always. Larry, well, you would go over really big. You could try playing. Oh, thank you, Ty Raven. I appreciate that. Nice to meet you, man. Thank you. We're, we're, we're just, you see, what happened was we're doing this live feed on Facebook, but because of their draconian um, bots, they kicked us off for 29 days, man. They gave us a 29, 29 strokes with a wet noodle sentence and um so now we decided we'll try this we'll try and bring it on to the the um youtube and see how we do on the youtube man with y'all man yeah so uh if not we'll have to behave welcome. ourselves larry what's going on buddy larry long i like that larry long larry long 20 days left on a 90 day sentence for posting a pro vaccine with the dancing was it said fuck. Oh dude, I'll tell you even but oh old saying if I used to drink a slab of every night, I used to drink a slab of every night, but now I just smoke a tree. I like that, Neil Hunt. That's a good one, man. I also smoke many trees. Larry, man. Um a friend of mine was doing a gig and he wrote, I had a really great I'm gonna have a really great gig tonight, and I said, kill him. And they sat in me for violence and bullying. <laughs> I mean, we got to get off Facebook, man. That's the bottom line, man. Yeah. So we're just trying to get everybody from that feed over here. But you know what's good? After we're done with this feed, we can post it on Facebook. Oh. Right? Oh, and then wow. have people come and join us. It's legal where I live, yeah. I know it's not legal in Australia and Thailand either, but there's plenty of weed in Thailand, man. Australia, man. I did a festival in Australia once. And the fucking, they had dogs walking through the crowds looking for weed. I swear to God, through the crowd. Wow. That's How crazy. could you have a good time that way, man? Not really? You know what I'm saying? That can't mm -hmm. be any fun. No. Mr. Smiley, that, no. That's not as much fun as, as what happened. <laughs> you had a little slip here. No, not really, right? Nobody saw anything. <laughs> Ah, uh, so who's just joined us? Hey guys, how you doing, man? It's Papa Chubby and Mistress Mary Beth, the mother of all spankings. Four twenty bong tokes with Papa Chubby and Mistress Mary Beth. We're back, people. That's right. Can't keep us down. Hey, subscribe to our channel, man. We're not asking you for any money. We just want to keep doing this, and we want to have fun and hang out because we're on the road so much, and we're playing. And Mistress Mary Beth has given spankings and. We're just so busy that we don't have time to just relax, unwind, man. Mm -hmm. Sit around with no pets, drink Diet Coke, smoke some weed with y'all. That's what I'm saying. That's what I do for fun. How about you? What do you do for fun? What do you guys do for fun? Tell me. Somebody tell me something. Tell me something good. What do you do for fun? What do you desire? What do you really desire? Come on, tell me. Will you tell me? Come on. Your version of Who Knows by Jimi Hendrix. Thank you, buddy. I really, it's it's Hendrix with an X, by the way. But that's cool. That's a great tune, man. Bam, bam, ba -dee, ba -dee, ba -dee, ba -dee, ba -dee. Well, we're kind of back on the air. We're trying to get, get it going, Larry Long. You know, we're we're definitely um gonna make this happen and it's gonna take a little time because um everybody's gonna find us. So we posted it on our our ah, face. Who's somebody it? from France is gonna pop from up. From France, America. Vive la France. Mm -hmm. Bonjour Jean Roring. Jean, bonjour Jean. Comment ça va à Matri? Mary Beth, da. Oh. Say, bonjour, Jean. Bonjour, Jean. Bonjour, Jean. Bonjour, Jean. 
Oui, bonjour, Jean. Comment ça va? My hair is a hot mess. C'est comment ça va? I hate this. <laughs> C'est comment ça va? Comment ça va? Gulf Coast of Florida, Amber. Oh, I'm jealous, man. I wish we were there right now, right, baby? Yeah. Gulf Coast of Florida. It sucks here, man. It's cold. It was fucking snowing today. There were snowflakes in the air, man. That's not good. Très bien. Merci. Merci, monsieur. Mon ami. Um, uh, le printemps. Um, C'est bon. Le vent rouge. You're jealous of what? Snow, Amber? No, 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 no. No, darling, no snow. Snow, very bad. Very bad. Very bad for Amber. I need to hang with Buddy Miles. Oh, Buddy, I played with Buddy, man. Buddy was the coolest dude. I played bass with Buddy because he was playing guitar at the time, left-handed. You know, something, there's nothing, sometimes there's nothing as satisfying as Diet Coke. I really miss doing this, Mistress Mary Beth. I know, me too. So it's good we got some folks out here. Yeah. Oh, you're from New Hampshire originally. Well, we were just up in um, Rochester, and it was cold as a witch's tit. First of all, I've known some witches, and their tits were never cold. Even in the cold? No. Well. So the, the saying, cold as a witch's tit, you know, the witches I knew had very nice, warm tits and lovely, inviting nippies and um so i think that's it's wrong to say that cold as a witch's tit it's not fair to witches man how about cold as will smith slap <laughs> who thinks will smith is a bitch out there come on let's take it let's take a vote oh. who thinks will smith that was a bitch ass move it was ridiculous i have heard of christone ingram have i heard of christone ingram oh have i heard of christone ingram that kid's a monster he's great He's an old soul in a young body. And he reminds me of me when I was young and fat. <laughs> As opposed to being... No, he really does. He reminds me of me like 30 years ago. Aww. Except he's better than me. Yeah. I missed out on the Will Smith news. What did I miss? Oh, my God. Well, yeah. well, Amber, let me let me run it down for you. It seems there was this little thing called the Academy Awards and Chris <laughs> Smith... Chris 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 Rock. Chris Rock was the MC, and he's a swarmy little asshole. He was making jokes about everybody, so he made a joke about Jada Pinkett Smith's hair by saying, "You're going to be in GI Jane too." Now she wasn't in GI Jane one, but unbeknownst to him and us, she had shaved her head because she has alopecia. So Will Smith laughs at the joke, but then he gets up and he goes over to Chris Rock and bitch slaps him. Proceeds to sit down and screams at the top of his lungs, "Keep your keep my wife's name out your motherfucking mouth!" Like he's like, you know, like he he's fucking um, I don't know, man, like ice ice cube or something, iced tea instead of um the Fresh Prince of Bel Air. He is the Fresh Prince of Bel Air. Plus, he's a punk ass bitch. He bitch slapped Chris Rock, but he also sucker punched him. Sucker punchers are always bitches, man. I know. I've been sucker punched. I have never sucker punched anybody. Never, man. I punch people in the face, mm -hmm. but I've never never sucker punched them. It's wrong. It looked fake. No, no, no. He really hit him. I thought so at first, too. Um, and even Mistress Mary Beth said, mm -hmm. and she's an expert at hitting. Right. So you know, you know, and you know, like some you know how to pull how to how to fake it, right? You know, yes, if you have if you have a slave who's mm -hmm. like really can't take a lot of pain, mm -hmm. so you know he really hit him. Yeah, it looked real to me. But it could be staged too. I did have that thought that it, you know. So I hope it was. If it was, good for them, man. But um, I don't know. He's a bitch, but I don't think it is because I think he's a Scientologist bitch. She is an expert at hitting Amber. Mistress Mary Beth is the mother of all spankings. That's me. It's just the way it is. How it works. Who out. am I? Who am I to argue? Oh. Uh oh. You can't hit. What? Well, Amber, 
Mistress oh. Marybeth, ambition needs lessons. Yeah. Go ahead. Why don't you take over? Take over uh, the feed for a second. I, I don't know how to give a lesson without a, a demonstration. <laughs> We're not no, having a demonstration. We are not having. Not a on this live feed. Sorry, guys. That's a that's different. A whole different that's a whole different feed. live feed. <laughs> we haven't gotten there yet. Um, but I will sing a little song for you. Will Smith is a big fat bitch. He's the biggest bitch in the whole wide world. He's the biggest bitch he's ever was. But he's a bitch to all the boys and girls. On Monday, he's a bitch. On Tuesday, he's a bitch. Wednesday and Thursday, he's a bitch. Then on Friday, he's such a bitch. You got to keep this YouTube friendly. We got to keep... No, actually, we don't because we age-restricted this feed. So there are no children allowed and no one under 18. We don't want them. Because like Mistress Mary Beth always says, spankings should be... Reserved for consensual adults. That's right. Never spank someone if they don't want it. Well, unless you know, unless they deserve it. <laughs> unless they deserve it, that's up to you, though. Right. Being the mother of all spankings, mm -hmm. right? Yes. So, um, yeah, man. I, so, why did I get thrown off of? Why did no one play that song? When we'll, right? Wouldn't that have been great? Check out the video. It's great. He just slaps the shit out of him. And then Chris Rock goes, Will Smith just slapped the shit out of me. <laughs> that was the perfect reaction. Like, unbelievable. He, he yeah. was... But he's a bitch. He's a little dude. And he didn't even Canadian. hurt him. He didn't even hurt him. I know, but he shouldn't, you know, be smacked for making a joke. Even if it's a bad So joke, what are we smoking on here? I don't know. We're smoking on some... Um, Stuff. Oh, no, no, we're smoking on the, mm, a lovely bud of um, apple fritter apple strain. Fritter, yeah, and say. it's very good. <laughs> Amber's new to that community. Well, Amber, I'm sure you can reach out to Mistress Mary Beth and mm -hmm. have a chat with her. Purple Crip and Space Age Cake here. Oh, nice, Amber. Oh, we like you even more. Amber is spanking curious and has some good weed. <laughs> there you go. We dig that, man. Amber, you you it's are one of the clan. We love you, Amber. Right in here. You'd fit right in. You'd fit right over Mistress Mary Beth's lap. Well, there is that. Mmm, the mother of all spankings. How's the apple fritter? I'll tell you right now. The Gorilla Crip whipped my butt last month. Gorilla Crip, man, you're getting some good strains down there, girl. Let's try this. But weed's not legal in Florida, is it? No. You only got the... the um Medical? Medical. Oh, the apple fruit is so good. <coughs> it's definitely a indica dominant. Yeah, I know you guys in Florida. So when I move down to Florida, I'll just have to get a medical card. <laughs> but um, man, it's got to be federally legal sooner or later. Do you buy a weed from the store dispensary? Sometimes I get weed from the dispensary because they have really good strains. Oh, you checked out Larry's um it did. video. Yeah, we checked it out, Larry. It was cool. Sometimes Ty Rave um Oh my god. Mm. Um sometimes we get weed from the dispensary, but we have to drive up to Massachusetts because even though it's legal in New York now, there are no recreational dispensaries, just medical dispensaries, and they don't have very good um, flour. But the dispensary not far from here has excellent strains with like They're very nice, a lot of THC. And um, and then you know I got I'm Papa Chubby man, so you know people give me weed. I know people. You know what I'm saying I know people. No people. I know people, they know people, we know people. Somebody knows somebody. Somebody knows somebody and they wind up <laughs> dropping me some bud. And um and that's a good thing. Like the other night in New in where were we? In in Massachusetts. Yeah. 
a friend of ours who's going to be playing bass with another. The bass player was with John Cougar. Oh, no fooling. John, Johnny Cougar menstrual cramp. Yeah. I mean, Mellencamp. And there's winners and there's losers. Vacation in the Gulf of Mexico. Little pink houses. Yeah, with cockroaches. Little pink houses. Ain't that America? Little pink houses. Nobody wants to work. Little pink houses. Biden's a jerk. Little pink houses. Go, Brandon. Little pink houses. <laughs> oh, sorry. I got crazy there for a second. Larry Long. Sometimes I go off on a little tangent. I get tangential. Tangent. You're in Long Island. Get out of here, Amber. Family roots. Where are you from in Long Island, Amber? Mistress Mary Beth is what was the premier <laughs> femdom and patchog. Stop. Yep, back in the deck. Hear the little story of Jack and Diane. Two motherfuckers do the best they can. <laughs> do you own your own tour bus? Yeah, it's a Chevy van. That's my tour bus. <laughs> Chevy van, <laughs> 15 passenger van. I'm the tour bus driver. Hi, that's for rock stars, man. I'm just a little blues rock guy. She was born in East Patchog. Uh, I, was actually, no, 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 no. I was actually born in uh, Mineola. But my oh, brother was born, was born in Patchog in Brookhaven. There you go. Yeah. No, Ty Rave, isn't it cool, man? You guys all think I'm some sort of big like Hoity Twitty rock star. I do play some big shows, but I'm not buying a muscle, man. He's got like fucking three tour buses and like 15 bus drivers. And he's got a tour bus for his tour bus. His tour bus rides in the tour bus. He's got a bus just for the bus drivers. Yeah. And me, Chevy Van. And then in the driveway, I also got a broken Ford van, which is now, st it's the pod. <laughs> yes. You know, look, man, it is what it is, the blues. That's why they, I guess that's why they call it the blues. Oh, I've got a golden crusted cock ring Eminem game. Oh, sorry. That's Elton <laughs> John. Did you know Eminem, Eminem, who is not in any way homophobic, is close friends with Elton John and and he gave Elton John and his husband his wedding present matching gold encrusted cock rings. No diamond encrusted cock rings. That was it. I too. thought that was awesome. <laughs> He's driving I would drive my wife's car, but it's busted in the lower driveway. She she's leaving it there for the for the home inspector <laughs> for the home inspector to say Mary Beth had to bring a little white trash, you know, <laughs> onto the property. <coughs> you heard it, Krusty and Eminem. No, I said Eminem is is close friends with Elton John, and for Elton John's wedding present for Elton John and his husband, Eminem gifted them matching gold. No. Diamond encrusted cock rings. I just think that's so cool, man. <laughs> that Elton John and Eminem. Because Elton, you know, Eminem, if you remember in his song, he said, if 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 a man can fuck a cantaloupe, why can't another man and a man elope? I thought that was really fucking awesome, man. Or fucking antelope or cantaloupe. Cantaloupe? Something you know, like that. I don't know. But uh yeah. Another man and a man can't why elope. why can't a man and another man elope? Yeah. And why can't another man and a man elope? Not in Florida, unfortunately, but uh mm -hmm. what are you gonna Isn't do, it, man? It, it is um federal. What is? Marriage laws are federal. I don't know. No, I don't think so. I think it's state by state. Really? Yeah. I don't think Yeah, so. California was the first state. Yeah, that allowed that way. allowed same sex marriage. Then Massachusetts, then New York. Mm -hmm. Oh man! Well, you know we had our own lovely governor Cuomo. How many days are you on the road every year? Um. Well, yeah, I have a big summer tour coming up, man. 
I have big tours coming up for the rest of the year, man. Um, you can check out my schedule at. Oh, I'm trying to do it like an iPad. That's funny. Uh huh. It's not type sense. I'm on the computer. W. Dot. Papa. Chubby. Dot com. Check out the tour schedule. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so, um, yeah, man, I'm getting really busy again. A lot of tours. Um, yeah, DeSantis is just, DeSantis wants to run for president, man. That should be great. Because I think Trump is screwed now because people are going to associate him with the Russians on some level. Whether he was or wasn't, do I think... I don't think Trump was in collusion with the Russians. I think they just used, I think they thought he was a fool and used him. I mean, Putin's so much smarter than Trump. And, the, you know, the problem is Vladimir Putin has a micro penis, very small, <laughs> small, that. teeny, tiny little penis, teeny, tiny. So he's like most men who have small penises, Hitler, um, Bill Cosby, um, I don't know, Jared from Subway. Um, they do stupid shit. So there you go. Not all men with small pieces do stupid shit. I don't. <laughs> yeah. All right. So let's smoke some more weed. What do you say? Who's down? Who's having a hit here? Come on. The whole point of this feed is we get stoned together. That's right. Everybody must get stoned. Well, they stone you and you walking down the street. They stone you and they say ain't that neat. Yeah, I know. I'm just saying that that's what will happen. So he's kind of out of it. So now DeSantis is going to. Want to step? He was. He wanted to step right in there and give it old Donnie anyway. So um, I'm voting for Joe Pesci in the next election. I'm writing him in because Joe Pesci gets shit done. Here's what I got to say: Vote for Joe. Oh, oh, Pesci. <laughs> I never did meet Taylor Hawkins, no, man. I didn't, but I did see a documentary with him. Yeah. And um, I think um, he was a junkie. Seriously. And I can tell you why I say that. Just watching him in his documentary, he had a dope fiend vibe. I can say that because I, 35 years ago, I was a dope fiend. 38 years ago, I was a dope fiend. I, I used to do heroin. So. Takes one to know one, man. I saw him. I went, this cat's fucking around. You can tell, man. You could just tell by the vibe people have, man. So, you know, he was the rich rock star with all the drugs. And what does that get you? Did. Yeah. Did. What do you call a rich rock star with a lot of drugs? Dead. What do you call a poor junkie? Dead. Yeah. Drugs kill. Stay away from drugs. Herb. Dijaja. Vibration. IRA, guidance and protection. <laughs> wow. <coughs> Clarity. A lot going on. Um, we got shows this weekend. This weekend plan in New Jersey April 1 Millville Millville New Jersey at Lavoie Theater and then April 2 oh. do who's Joey Diaz I don't know who Joey Diaz is, Amber. Help me out here. <coughs> Tommy Lee. Mm -hmm. Oof. 
Oof, Tommy Lee's rough, man. Mm -hmm. Um, you know, the only thing I know about Tommy Lee for sure is I saw that video, man. And um, you know, the sex video with him and um Yeah. What's your name? Yep. Fucking uh uh Spamela. Spamela Anderson. Holy shit. <laughs> Holy fucking shit. Dude's hung like a fucking horse, man. Holy shit. After I watched that video, I was like, I'm never fucking having sex again. What's the point? How the fuck hang with Tommy Lee is, is right, Larry Long. <laughs> yeah. How could you not see it? Jesus Christ. <laughs> April 2nd. Stage one. Fairfield CT. There we go. So that's what's going on. Then we're going to Europe. Europe. April 6th. That's it. And then we're back here. Four more lovely shows. I appreciate you too, Amber. You're awesome, man. And um, we really like you. And we hope to um, that you come back and see us, man. I'm, you know, I'm not, you know, I don't mind uh, that Tommy Lee's got 10 times the penis of any man I've ever seen. And that's just the way it is, man. Yeah. Dude, here's what I learned about that, all right? Here's what I learned by going to the gym when I was a kid. You know, you start going to the gym, you get locker room, guys shower and they change, and you get to see it. Everybody sees everybody else's junk, and there's no justice. <laughs> First of all, all the cliches you've been taught are incorrect, okay? Black men do not always have huge penises. Asian men do not always have small penises. Jews, well, they always have big balls. Um, but in all honesty, man, there's no rhyme or reason to this shit, man. And, you know, sometimes too, you know, look, man, all you guys out there, you know what happens, man. You go to the urinal, you take it out, you start peeing, you can't help but glance over, you're like, you know, what's he packing? And you're like, ah, shit. But it reminds me of a joke, right? Oh, no. You guys want to hear a joke? <laughs> all right. This guy is in the urinal, and he's peeing, and he looks over, and he sees this little tiny guy. He's about three foot tall with flaming red hair, a green suit, a little red beard. And he notices that this little guy with the red beard, <laughs> check him out. Some He's got some Joey Diaz. Oh, I know Joey Diaz, of course. Now that you said it, it makes sense. Uh, anyway, he looks over and the little leprechaun's got a huge, huge schlong, man. And he says, listen, I just, I'm really sorry. I couldn't help but looking over, as men usually do. And I notice you're this little tiny guy and you have this huge schlong and here I am. I'm this big hulking dude and I'm really average and it's it's really kind of depressing, and the little guy goes, "Well, you see, I'm a leprechaun, and we have magical powers." And he goes, "Really? Well, you're a leprechaun, and I just caught you here, and um, you know, by rights, you have to grant me a wish." He goes, "Well, before I do that, Joey, I got to tell you something." He says, well, "What's that?" He goes, "I grant you wish, but if you want to have, what's your wish?" And Joey says, "Well, I want to have a big schlong." He goes, "Well, if you want." Well, every big slug like me, you have to let me give it to you right up the old back door there. <laughs> and he goes, well, you know, I'm really not into that kind of thing, but anything to be hung like you. So he starts giving it to Joey, and he's giving it to him. He's like, so tell me, Joey, where are you from? He goes, well, I'm, I'm from New Jersey. He goes, and Joey, how old would you be? Oh, I'm 46. He goes, well, you stupid bastard, you're 46, you still believe in leprechauns. <laughs> oh, 
That's terrible. Got to drive up here, Amber. A token our future. It would have been better if that was a funny joke, though, right? Ha. Huh. Anyway. So, yeah, man. Here we are. We met Amber tonight, which is pretty cool. Yeah. Amber's cool. And who else? Larry found yeah. us, which is awesome. Yeah. And other people will find us now that we're doing this. Uh -huh. I think we got to do it at the same time every day, Mr. Yeah, Trebek, which would probably option. be 420. Right. Right? That's how we started this. We did. We started at 420. Mm -hmm. But it's kind of nice on the computer, right? Mm -hmm. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. So, um, let's see. What else can we talk about? Will Smith. Um, <laughs> the mother of spankings. Um, hmm. Well, at least we know everybody on this feed is over 18. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I guess you get a lot of trouble if they weren't. Yeah, I would think so. Oh, somebody new just popped up and. How's it going, Jace? The message. What happened? It had a message and now it's gone. Who did that? Jace. Oh, he's right here. That's oh, he just said, "Hey, how's it going?" Yeah. And I said, "How you doing, Jace?" Oh, here it is. He's back. Yeah. What's going on, buddy? Welcome to our live feed. We're hanging out. We're smoking some weeds. Did you smoke any weed, baby? I did. I smoked some weed. Show everybody the new um one hitter that I got you. Did you lose it already? No, I got it right here. Look at it. It's wood, and it's got a metal tip. How cool is that for the marijuana smoking? We got crab. Jason is in Australia, too. What's going on, man? How are you, Jace? We got a lot of Australians here today. I've been to Australia one time in my life. And I didn't see one damn kangaroo. <laughs> it's bad. What? I shouldn't smoke weed. What do you mean it's bad for my music? Explain that, Jace, please. Tell me how smoking weed is bad for my music. Oh. <coughs> I'm really good, man. I think smoking weed is good for my music mm -hmm. because when I smoke weed, I'm not an asshole. No. Usually. <laughs> Sometimes I'm an asshole. Yeah, we're gonna do it on a regular schedule. We're just we're kind of just um getting back in the game tonight here. So we figured we'd pop one out. <laughs> oh well, yeah, smoking is not good for you. You're right, Chase, but you know. I do so many good things for me. I do so few bad things for me. 34, congratulations, Amber. Mm -hmm. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Amber, who's in Aries. Happy birthday to you. Yeah, we hear that you're new. We hear that you're new. To the live feed, it's true. So happy birthday to you. And a spanking, <laughs> birthday spanking, Mistress Mary Beth. Come on. Yeah, get the paddle. Get I the paddle. I didn't bring it You got to get the paddle for, for uh, Amber. Come on. No. What do you mean, no? I don't know where I put it. You don't know where you put your paddle? Yeah. What kind of mother of all spankings are you I don't know. without I'm your paddle? Like Where's that. my paddle? I bought that today. I bought it because I lost my one hitter. Well, it's actually Mr. Mr. Mary Beth's one hitter. <laughs> we got all sorts of good weed. That other cat gave us some good weed. Yeah. Our friend, remember? Mm -hmm. Whose name we don't know who's going to be playing bass for <laughs> Albert Castilla. Here we go. Ooh. Yes, indeed, you do. How much World War Three is mentioned in. Oh, fuck World War Three. <laughs> Ty Rave, you know what, man? The media is full of shit, man. They really are. They, sh you know, it's like I don't know, man. You know, it's um, uh, 
Australia has some darn good shows. They do, like, um, what's his name? Um, the guy who got killed by the fucking Stingray. Oh, Steve Irwin. Steve Irwin, yeah. Yeah. Dumbass. <laughs> what's my favorite gemstone? <laughs> my favorite gemstone is coal. <laughs> Because when I was a kid, my mother told me, Steve Irwin, that's the guy. Now his um, wife's showing it out, and his daughter, who's pretty hot, I have to say, and his son, who's very gay, and, um, you know, they're keeping it going, man. My favorite guitar is the Fender Stratocaster, Jace. The only guitar for a man to play. That's not true, but. <laughs> what are you taking the rain check on, Amber? <laughs> I don't know what I said. <laughs> I'm stoned. Oh, she's going to take a rain check on the spanking. Ah. Hmm. Mistress Mary Beth. I'm getting a feeling Amber's going to have to get a spanking one of these yeah. days. Yeah. That's just the way it is. It is. You got one, Jace? What kind of Stratocaster you got? I have about... How many Stratocasters do I have? I have no idea. 30, 40? A lot yeah. of Stratocasters. They're like candy. I want them in all colors. <laughs> every color of Stratocaster. Every shape and size. All right. So now this weed I'm about to smoke. Mm -hmm. I don't know the name of it because a friend of mine grew this. My favorite guitar would have to be the Les Paul. Of course, you would say Les Paul because I had said Stratocaster. <laughs> and a Marlboro, I remember those. Those were cool, man. From her Marlboro Miles. Dude. Remember that shit. Wasn't that great? Marlboro Miles? My mother used to get those, man. But she'd get like a blanket. <laughs> Oof. Dude, you are so wrong, man. I am such a hack. I can. <laughs> <laughs> he says, I can tell with the guitar playing that at some point you achieve this amazing proficiency. <laughs> <laughs> you must be talking about Eric Gales. <laughs> An ability when you yeah. copy songs by ear. Um, I do have pretty good ears. See? I have two of them. And uh, my wife likes to grab them. Grab my ear, baby. Mm. Oh, Mistress Mary Beth, no. <laughs> Um, I'll tell you what, it's really good, this weed. <coughs> well, the charge to play Stratocasters we have Jimi Hendrix, we have Mark Knopfler, we have Ingve Malmsteen, we had Eddie Van Halen play the Stratocaster light guitar. Oh, Amber. <laughs> Naughty Amber. <laughs> um, who else plays Stratocaster? David Gilmore played Stratocasters. Um, so many. Oh, Richie Blackmore, Alicia Barakamore, as they say in Japan. Alicia Barakama, Stevie Ray Vaughan, Walter Trout, my old buddy Walter Trout, Wally as we call him. He hates that if you call him Wally. <laughs> Don't ever call Walter Trout Wally. He'll kick your ass. He can get really mean. Trust me. I know. Now, Stevie Ray Vaughan, there was a great guy with three names. <laughs> yeah. Na, 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 na. I got a blue and gray Stratocaster. Oh, now we're going to wait. We went from spankings to guitar talk. Apparently. <laughs> no way. They got Marlboro points now. <laughs> Get an iron lung. 50,000 Marlboro points for an iron lung. 100,000 for asthma inhalers. <laughs> Jimmy Vaughan plays a Stratocaster. Robert Cray. Here's another one. And um, occasionally, Joe Bonamassa has played a Stratocaster, he's, even though he's more of a Les Paul guy. Um, so many people play the Stratocaster. 
I love them very much. They are my favorites. I love the Stratocaster of Disaster. I can't believe they brought back Marlboro Miles, man. That seems so wrong in this culture, right? Yeah. But you know what? what's interesting? Yeah, it's like with all the bullshit about smoking's bad for you, you know, blah, blah. Mm-hmm. More people are smoking than ever. A lot of stress. Yeah, but smoking tobacco doesn't really help stress. Smoking weed helps stress. Robert Craig, John Meyer, Kenny Wayne Shepard. Yeah, man. He got it, Jace. Keep it going, man. So many. Marcus Knopfler is a great guitar player, man. Really a brilliant guitar player. I wish I could play like that. <laughs> Mr. Swain, about tell everybody sometimes I play the guitar on you when we're sleeping, right? I play it on your bottom. Yeah. Just like this. I was like, come here, give me that bottom. That's b- b- right. And I'm playing guitar oh right, my God, it's right on her little tissue. <laughs> right on her little tissue. Just funny. like that. Hmm. All right, geez. Well, I have to get down there to Australia again, man. They got to bring me back down there, man. I've been trying to get on the Byron Bay Blue, f- Blue f- <laughs> The Byron Bay Blue Festival. <laughs> the Byron Bay Blues Festival. My oldest Stratocaster is a 1964. The one I play mostly is a 1966. That's my honey. Mistress Mary Beth is my honey. What? And my mistress. Yes, mistress. Yes, mistress. Yes, my love. Yes, my mistress. You should look that up, man. Look that shit up. But I'll tell you what, man. I also deal in vintage guitars. I have a company called Chub Father Vintage, being I am the Chub Father. That's right. Look how good looking I am. <laughs> um, yeah, man. I like Australia, man. It's a beautiful place. Oh, yeah, Amber, you got some good stuff from them? That's cool, man. I bet they make good stuff. Do you smoke a lot of Marlboros in, Amber? I bet you do. Amber, do you smoke a lot of Marlboros? Tell Papa Chubby. <laughs> Don't lie. <laughs> Mr. Smarry Beth used to smoke the... What'd you smoke? Capri. Capri, strip of cigarettes. <laughs> the ones the hook is smoked, so I've heard. Mm. The dominatrices. Being unique, do you know Reverend Robert? Reverend Robert, no. Reverend Robert whom? The tissue guitar. Her, I'm going to play her little tissue guitar. That's right. All night long, right on her tissue. <laughs> oh, strum that shit. <laughs> 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 she likes that. Oh. I love America too. I've been to Hawaii. Oh, I love Hawaii. <laughs> I haven't been to Hawaii. The next time I go to Hawaii, though, it's just going to be to hang out, man. I got some good friends there and some not so good friends. Mm-hmm. I had a good friend there, but he turned out. You ever have somebody you thought was a really good friend and you haven't seen them in a long time? And then they come and they stay in your house. And they record for free in your recording st- studio, and you get them a gig, and um, and then they come to you and demand more money for the gig. Yeah. So I have a not, I have a not so good friend in Hawaii, Rob Kennedy. Um, but that's right. That's the way it goes. Say la vie. Wow. Yeah, man. Well, I'm not, you know, I'm a mediocre guitar player. I'm getting worse by the day. <laughs> oh, mom and aunt smoked that. Yeah. When I was a kid, Amber, <laughs> all the ladies in my house used to smoke. My mom, my aunts, my grandma. And they used to give me money with lists to go to the store 
and get cigarettes. And if I came back with the wrong cigarettes, I got a spanking. That's the way it was. So I had a, you smoke a lucky strikes. Wow. That's hardcore, man. I have some acoustic guitars, Jace. Lucky is so she's a smoker. Amber's yeah. a smoker too, mommy. Oh. What do you think about that? Naughty girl, I think. Yeah. I think we're dealing with a naughty girl here. I think so. Mm. Chase, what kind of acoustic guitar do you play? <laughs> My friend, do you tell? Oh, yeah. Damn, that was good, Mr. Mary Beth. Yeah. I got to say. Those catfish keep making croaking noises today. <gasps> they are, aren't they? Yeah. Oh, well. Must be that time of year for them. Amber, we're going to, I think we're going to, what do you think, Mr. Mary Beth? Should we bid farewell to yeah, all our I'm, friends here? I'm getting tired. On our first feed. It's so nice to see you all. Amber, happy birthday, my dear. How come Joe Bonamara charges a $200 ticket? Because mm -hmm. he can get it. Yeah. Because that's his value. Because a lot of people will pay $200 mm -hmm. to see Joe Bonamassa. Just like not as many people. Uh, you know, Amber, I used to think that too. But then I realized... Karma is a lot more complicated than people make it out to be. People mix up karma with revenge. Now, what is karma? Says Professor Chubby. <laughs> ah, yes. Grasshopper, I will tell you. I will instruct you in the ways of karma. Karma is the wheels of the universe <laughs> whirring. And the sound is home. Home. This is Mary Beth, if you will, with me. Okay. With me. Home. No, you're not naughty. You're you're a very naughty girl, Amber. I can tell. I know one when I see one. <laughs> Believe me. But that's okay. We love naughty girls. So you just enjoy yourself. Be careful out there. And come back and see us again by all means. And um, so karma is everything. So um, you could just say, man, they'll get what's coming to them. That's a good one, I think. So uh, this was fun. We got to meet some new friends. Yeah. And um, we hung out and talked some bullshit. Yeah. Smoked some weed. Have a very awesome evening, everybody. Bye-bye. Say goodbye, Mrs. Mary Beth. Happy spankings.